Alright, I've uh, got a battle here against Tutoshio from Smogon. Um, he leads with the Tyranitar, I lead with the Zapdos, and uh, he outspeeds me and uses st Stealth Rock. So I guess he's a Scarf Tar with Stealth Rock, which is interesting but good to know. I just uh, U-turned out expecting him to be slow, and I go to Swampert, who uh, sets up Stealth Rock, because that's what Swampert does. And uh, he goes to a Skarmory, so... I don't really, I can't really take him out with Swampert, so I go to Heatran, he sets up spikes, and I'm just going to go for the Fire Blast since I've only seen two things on his team. It misses, but that's not too big of a deal because it wouldn't have done any damage to Tyranitar anyway, really, so I just send Swampert back in. He gets the special def or the defense drop with Crunch, but uh, I know he's not going to stay in, I'm not either, so I'm actually going to switch right back out to Heatran. And he goes back to Skarmory, so I figure he'll expect me to predict something this time and not go for the Fire Blast, so I do go for the Fire Blast, and he stays in, and I'm able to take out his Skarmory, which is pretty useful. Um, I think Wall's a few things on my team, so it's nice to have it out of the way. Um, he probably thinks I'm Scarfed, so he sends in Kingdra. I hit it with a Dragon Pulse, which... Uh, doesn't quite kill it, but he predicted my switch and goes for a Draco Meteor, which misses, so I am able to finish it off with another Dragon Pulse, and he's going to send in an Infernape. I don't really want anything to take a close combat, so I just sacrifice Heatran. It would have probably, in the long run, been a better move to go to Gyarados right there, but... I didn't feel like it because Stealth Rock is up, so I switch in Gyarados now that I know he's not going to have to take a close combat, and he sends in a Rotom. I just go for the Waterfall because I hadn't seen enough of his team to feel safe Dragon Dancing yet, and uh, right here, since my Heatran is dead, I expect him to go for the Will-O-Wisp because it's almost completely safe, so I go for the Taunt. But he just finishes me off with a Discharge, which is not that good, um, but I switch into Swampert, because I figure I can survive the Shadow Ball, and a Torrent Boosted Surf would take him out, but uh, unfortunately it does not, and after Sandstorm, he lives with like, 1 or 2 HP, and, uh... I decide to save Swampert as Death Fodder to possibly scout his Tyranitar or something, because I know it's Scarfed, so I switch out to Scizor, which probably wasn't the greatest move, because I now take Spikes and Stealth Rock damage, but I am able to finish him off with a Bullet Punch. And, uh, he's just gonna send Infernape back in, and... Here, I actually am going to sacrifice the Swampert, which does do something useful, because it does get a defense drop on him. Unfortunately, Scissor's Bullet Punch would not be able to KO him right here, because it's, well, it would have had like a 50% chance when I didn't want to risk it. So I go to Tyranitar, and unfortunately he's one of those Infernaps with Mock Punch, and uh, he does get a crit, but it doesn't matter because... After Stealth Rock and Spikes, he would have taken me out anyways. So I go back to Scizor. I figure I can finish him off with a Bullet Punch. I did not expect him to Mock Punch me. I actually expected him to use Close Combat or Flamethrower or something in case I tried to Roost or something. So that really sucks and means that my Scizor cannot switch back into anything. Which means I will not be able to take out Tyranitar, so, uh, he goes to a Flygon, kills my Scizor, and he's gonna kill my Zapdos with Outrage, I think. Actually, no, I live, and I am able to finish off the Flygon with a Hidden Power, but I can't take a Scarf Tyranitar, so that was a very good, very close game. I made some mistakes, but... You deserve to win, so good game. Rate, comment, sub. Thanks for watching. Bye.